Hi everyone, this is Kieran Beach and today we're going to perform two moves, the clamp and the crippler and then we're going to put them together in a little combination at the end, clamp, crippler, clamp. So we're going to break down the move, the clamp first. So to perform the clamp, all you're basically doing is cushioning the ball with your toes and letting your heel sit on the floor. The most part of your weight is actually on the toes, but you sort of once you get comfortable, you'll sort of distribute the weight between the um, toes and the heel. Get used to doing it on a moving ball, as it's a great little tackle or steal. Next up is the crippler. So what you're doing with this is your foot on top of the ball. You're going to roll it forward. And then basically it's the similar kind of move but this time you're going to put all the weight on the toes and just cushion the ball with the heel. Now put them together, so you perform a clamp, cushion the ball, have it nice and comfortable, roll it back and then just go into a crippler. Now you're going to put them all together, the clamp and the crippler and the clamp. So perform your clamp. This time when you perform your crippler though, what you're going to notice is I'm not doing it like I was before. All I'm doing is keeping contact with the sole of my toes and then just rolling the ball and then performing the crippler. Uh, on the cl last clamp, I step over with my opposite leg after I perform the crippler. So that twists over the body. And then this allows me again to twist and clamp the ball. You can let go of it like I did in this bit or you can keep it together. All I'm doing then is putting the moves together in a combination again, like the one I showed at the start. Uh, and then the next combination is just individually putting the moves into a combination. So the crippler, the clamp. Massive thank you for watching this video, if you enjoyed it please uh, let me know uh, and if you've got the time and you fancy it please subscribe.